So day of prayer is a time that as Briarcrest students, we can come together and have fellowship together in prayer. It's a time where we are able to celebrate the work that God is doing here at Briarcrest as well as around the world. And we are able to come to him surrendering what we need prayer for as well as the things that are happening, um, whether that be here on campus or in other places that we haven't even been before. We all come together around nine o'clock and um, we do things like confession, we do worship, we, uh, we do times of silence. It's crunch time and finals are approaching and it's, it's good to, to make specific time to come before our Father. So you might think that it's not as stressful, but, um, but it is heavy and it's, it's spiritually heavy and it's emotionally heavy. And, and th through day of prayer and leading to the days afterwards, you kind of feel this, this sense of, of thick contemplation about what day of prayer was and how we can um, put that into our lives practically for the days ahead. Uh, we hear stories of people just that, that come to day of prayer just, just really burdened with things, whether it's um, just sin or doubt or whatever's going on in their life, and, and they leave day of prayer changed. There's healing and there's confession and some people just didn't really see anything different. And so I think it's just like a time where we just surrender things to God and, and He works in different ways for different people. We don't only need to come to God when we are struggling, but we can come to Him just in our everyday lives. And prayer is communication with our King and He wants us to be communicating with Him. Walking around and seeing all the whiteboards that we have set up in the chapel where everyone can come around and write down things that are happening in their personal lives, in their family, in their churches, uh, prayer requests that have to deal with, with world issues, with politics, and, and seeing exactly how broken everybody is, but also how much redemption that we have within Christ and through His sacrifice. Yeah, I just found it <laughs> just almost heartbreaking when there was so many things written down that I was almost moved to tears because I'm like, I can't, I like, you know, I can't do this, but the beautiful thing is that we all share uh, each other's burdens together and we share um, the burden of the world together. People usually leave with just um, just feeling refreshed and, and feeling that burden lifted um, and, and just that, an increased hunger for, for God.